Hey, what's up guys, Bennett Pro Fixer, and today we'll be talking about how to remove the HDMI port from a PS4. This is incredibly easy and simple to do, but so many people struggle. I've seen a lot of weird things where people either pry it off with pliers or they cut it with wire snippers, which kind of blows my mind because it does not follow any kind of soldering technique that I've ever seen in my life. In this video, we're actually gonna remove it in under one minute. To see the actual time that we removed it, make sure you watch the video, pay attention to the super simple steps, but I'll tell you right now, it's literally as easy as just heating it up and letting it come off like melted butter. Let's check it out. Hey, what's up everyone? It's Ben from ProFixer, and I'm gonna show you how you can remove your HDMI port from the board in under a minute. I've seen that a lot of people have struggles with this where they're prying it off or cutting it off. Totally don't need to do that. You can just take it off with just hot air. Um, we're gonna add a little bit of flex to it. I have my timer here as well. So, um, you know, just so you can actually see this is real time. It's not sped up or anything like that. Um, so basically we'll put a bunch of flux around it. And the stuff that I'm using is this uh, 559, Amtec works really good, like it a lot. Have no nozzle on my hot air. The hot air is actually turned to 415. Um, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna start this timer and then we are going to pull it off. So here we go. So start. All right. So basically just hold the hot air underneath the port itself. Just like I'm here, kind of blow it out a little bit to uh, you know come out from underneath the board. That way it's coming out this way. And I'm actually holding my finger here, um, touching the bottom of the table to kind of stabilize the hot air. That's just a little trick. And we're cutting it pretty close down to 21 seconds left. Uh, we'll see if we can do it. Alright, cool. It's loose now. There we go. Just like butter. 15 seconds to go. Um, so definitely very doable in under a minute. And don't have to worry about prying or pulling off any kind of pads or causing any kind of damage that way. Also, no low melt needed. So, appreciate y'all watching. And, uh... I appreciate y'all watching and hopefully this will help you pull off the HDMI ports a little more efficiently and a little more confidently. Just use hot air with an open end at uh, 415 and you'll get it off in under a minute. I appreciate everyone that's still watching. If you like this video, go ahead and hit the like button. If not, the other button seems to work okay too. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the notification button. All the parts and equipment that I use in this video are linked up in the description below. As well, there's a link for our PS4 HDMI repair course. It's all online and at your own pace. We teach how to effectively and efficiently perform this repair. So don't forget to take a look. This is a reliable and sustainable revenue stream that you can add to your repair shop. I'll see you later.